on guys we just left the gym did a little chest action chest and abs had uh, it's Saturday morning got some time off we're going to what you guys asked me to do we're going grocery shopping now there's three places around here where we can go there's um, obviously is a Walmart super center there's a price chopper and Hannaford obviously the Walmart's probably the cheapest but you know that's a whole ordeal where we got to go to Walmart so we're not going there we're going to Hannaford today they're pretty reasonable they usually have some good chicken, some steaks, and stuff like that. So, we're gonna bring you guys a little grocery shop action post workout, and we'll see you there. All right, everybody, we're in Operation Grocery Shopping. First stop, let's see how much the chicken breasts are. Because if they're out of hand, you know, there's two other places to go, so we're gonna check it out. Yeah, so that's not gonna happen. That's not gonna happen. Yeah guys, so I'm not gonna spend almost twenty dollars for like five chicken breasts. So looks like we're leaving. Heading to either Price Chopper or Walmart, and usually Hannaford and Price Chopper are like the same prices when it comes to chicken. So we're gonna have to suck it up and head over to Walmart, which isn't bad, but just kind of had of a headache there. But we're gonna go. We'll check out Walmart. And if Walmart prices are are about the same, then we'll go to Price Chopper, and then uh, we'll figure it out from there. So, leaving Hanford now. We'll try again. Not today, Hanford. Not today. So this is why I never come here. I had to park like in an other parking lot. Just so busy, but we'll check it out just for today. All right, guys, pretty big difference here. About ten dollars instead of about twenty dollars, so that's what I'm going with. So the way I grocery shop, like you can already tell, is I go straight for the chicken because that's one of the biggest things I always get. And then I go back to the beginning. So we're going to grab some half and half, some eggs over the dairy. We're gonna start there. Well, after the chicken. So I noticed that I'm not really eating many eggs anymore. I was having a lot of um, egg whites at one point but um, it's kind of died down I just have my uh, with my schedule I just really go straight into work and stuff so I'll have my protein shake and I might pick up a bagel so we're gonna move on from the dairy so we're in the oatmeal section and normally I would get oats but I have like five pounds of the Quaker down here. So, not a necessity right now, but normally I'd get them. I guess some pancake syrup too. But, um, because I showed you guys that one. In my last day of eating or dieting, I throw the pancake syrup or something in there. But I might pick up some more pancake syrup. Sugar-free IHOP, original, we'll go original, 55 grams of 
carbohydrates pre-workout. I'll take that. So I just picked up some 93% lean ground turkey. Um, let's see, two and a half pounds each. So I got um, five pounds of that. And I'm just gonna cook up and put in a container and take as I go throughout the week. And I'm also gonna grab some of these um, 90 second cook. Just throw it in the microwave, really convenient, really easy to just take on the go. So I'm gonna grab about like five or six different ones. There's a bunch of them. I'm gonna grab a couple whole grain though. And the beef's really good. I've had like all of them. They're not all that good, but try them for yourself though. These are really good to take on the go though. Post-workout meal, anything like that. Pretty good. So I just grabbed a six rice and I also grabbed the, some tuna. I like just having the tuna with salt and pepper and I grabbed some more mustard. That's really good. I like that. Um, right now we got actually a lot of food. Um, got some crackers to snack on. I usually don't eat that until the weekend so I don't have anything going on but I got some two chickens, two ground turkey, some tuna, rice. We'll grab some vegetables and uh, maybe some potatoes. I have some already, but we'll check. So I just grabbed a bunch of frozen greens. I do it that way. I got Brussels sprouts, broccoli, carrots, that kind of stuff. Just mixed greens. I like it the best like that. Um, just throw it in the microwave whenever you need it so it's not just sitting around and I don't have to go to the grocery store to grab um, vegetables all the time so so we're almost done we uh, I just grabbed a thing of bagels to have uh, one or half a one post-workout this week. Um, <clears throat> I would do that a lot during competition time, have half a bagel or something. So, grabbed one of those. Um, I don't need potatoes because I have potatoes at home, sweet potatoes. Um, and my box of Ritz crackers is open. I just noticed that, so I'm bringing that back. And I need to get some, I'm trying to look for some rock stars, some sugar free rock stars to hit that, uh, you know, I just bring it with me during the day. I like them. So I'm looking for that right now. And we're almost done. Found them. Um, there was only one though, and it's a four pack. So I'm not counting on them being here anymore. It sucks. I can't find them anywhere. I got a 10 pack of monsters the other week, and now I'm getting dog food for my puppy. That's pretty much it, guys. Um, I already have potatoes at home. I have fish at home. So I had got chicken, ground turkey, um, for turkey burgers. I like to just eat it, just cook it and eat it. And um, I have those at home. What else do I have at home? I think that's it. So if I want like a steak or something during the week, I just run to the store and grab a steak. I don't need to buy it right now because I don't want to freeze it. Um, like these chickens, I'm going to cook when I go home. Same with the ground turkey. 
I'll cook it when I go home, put it in a container, and just take it when I need it. It's the easiest way to do it. Same thing with the rice. Those are in the little bag, so I don't need to pre-cook rice and throw it in a container and put it in the refrigerator. Just shopping more convenient to make it, things easier throughout the week. So, um, yeah, I'll cook it, and I'll show you guys all that stuff. So that was my trip to Walmart. I hate this place. It's all right, though. It's all right, place. Could be better. Just packed on a Saturday. But I already knew that, so. So we're finally out of there. We left with just over, or just under, $100. So, good with that for the week. Throw all these bags that we got. Bunch of them. And she double bagged, like, everything which I guess is cool but took forever so I'll put all these away go home and I'll show you before the end that I'll just cook all this stuff and put it away under a hundred dollars for the week I feel like that's pretty damn good I got about I don't know, like 10 chicken breasts. Those are big chicken breasts too, so probably won't eat the entire thing for a serving. But, so we also got the uh, ground turkey. And um, so yeah, I think we did pretty good. I mean, we got fish and fish and uh, potatoes at home too, so. We'll be good for the week. And so that was my awesome trip from the gym to the grocery store to the car, the RX-8. It's pretty nice. So let's see, we got chicken, ground turkey, for our mains, we got um, rice, frozen veggies, vegetables, um, don't remember what else. Those are the main things though. That's the stuff I'm going to be bringing with me during the day. Um, cook all the... Uh, the chicken breasts, and I don't know if I'll cook all of them. I really just don't like freezing things and then have to um, defrost them and then cook them again because it takes like 15 minutes to defrost a chicken breast that size. So I just don't like doing that, but um, we'll see. We'll, we'll drop all this stuff off home and I'll show you guys um, what we do next. So just put everything away. I think yeah so we got our ground turkey we got five pounds like I said we bought all this stuff for $86 got our chicken breast at the bottom we got like I said we have the uh, tilapia already so we got the uh, frozen vegetables we got this pancake syrup for the morning rock stars the rice that we got up here. We got all our rice right there. And our tuna. So we got a little more tuna now. And um, like I said, we got oatmeal. I already have some oatmeal. I got another bag in here. Got a big box of it. There's another bag in there. I already have sweet potatoes already. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to cook chicken and ground turkey. And I might only do one thing of chicken because we still have 
Well, no, maybe I will. We have one chicken breast in there already from last time we cooked. But, um, so they're going to go in here. Get the chicken in here. The ground turkey in here. And I'm just going to put it in the refrigerator and, uh, call it a day. So I'll just revisit that whenever I'm hungry. Whenever I'm out during the day, whatever I have to take with me, I'll just take with me. Really convenient shopping, really easy. Um, the minute rice, the microwave vegetables, already cook my, um, you know, meat, fish, whatever it is. Put it in the refrigerator, grab and go. So really cutting, cutting down on time, which is great. I love doing that. And Jax is really hungry. Come here. Oh, there's Jax. Look, Jax. Oh, oh. So, I'm going to go cook this. And uh, that's my grocery shopping, guys.